want to just get like a, an example from each of you, like an artist or campaign that kind of blew off based on Lego and the big L. I have a really good example, actually. Yeah. Um, one of my first signings, I signed this person in 2017, um, is an artist called Ben Weimer. Um, he, one of his first artist albums, he uh, wrote the track Breathing. It was a lead single from the album. Um, we found that it was really picking up momentum on Sirius XM, which is uh, the most listened to radio station in the state. We found that that wasn't translating into Spotify streams. No one was streaming it, weirdly, but it was like the most listened to track on Sirius XM Chill. It was a massive money earner for us, but it was still on like 500,000 streams or something. So then that was a great example of us then going back and repitching the track to Spotify a year after the release and telling them that we have 150 Sirius XM plays. The track is taken off in the States. Can you please revisit? And now the track is sitting on 55 million streams of Spotify. Ben Boma is, you know, like one of the biggest acts in dance music at the moment. And it's, uh, you know, like sort of sold out like 110 shows last year. So it's all off the back of that one single. Yeah. And that was all based from that radio data, that Sirius XM data. And um, going back to Spotify with that was really powerful.